In Indiana, there's a retirement home like no other. Peaceable Primates is the last stop for baboons once used in research. Even though there's room to expand, unlike many animal rescues, the main structures and supplies were all set in place before the first animal was received. Due to the stress to the animals that construction can cause, Peaceable Primates made sure it made the right choice to complete items such as holding areas, stocked with behavior enrichment, a food prep area with walk-in refrigerators, solar panels, and storage areas before they could accept baboons. A quick tour of one storage area showed the former homes of these baboons once used in research. It is a controversial topic using primates such as baboons in research. Today there are just under 100,000 primates housed at research centers and universities all in the name of science. The scientific community will point to advances like chimpanzees helping in the research of a vaccine for hepatitis B virus. But not only animal rights advocates, but the general public often wonders, is the compromised welfare worth it all? A baboon is a highly social animal, and here at the sanctuary, these primates that were once housed alone can now enjoy each other's company. These animals have only been here for a short while, and already you can see the change in their behavior. Large outdoor habitats allow them to not only walk, but to run and jump, as this is an animal that would travel five to seven miles a day. Baboons are highly intelligent, but they can also transmit diseases to humans, so very special care is needed to take these animals in. The sanctuary was started by Scott Kubich, who has over 20 years experience in the zoo field. The background familiarized him with the need of behavior enrichment, which could be something as simple as a structure to climb on, or peanuts to crack open. It felt good to watch these fellow primates get the respect that they deserve. After years and years in indoor labs, they finally had an outdoor area with other baboons to call home. I look forward to watching peaceful primates expand and welcome in new residents. To keep up on the great work being done, please read this video's description. And as always, thanks for watching.